And as for any ice on the roads, it's still too early to know if that's a real possibility for Sunday and Monday, but TxDOT in Fort Worth is already treating its highways and interstates as a precaution. The Dallas district says it plans to begin its preparations Friday. Fox 4's Lori Brown is live with more. Hi, Lori. Hi, Clarice. TxDOT's Fort Worth spokesman says the department has been closely monitoring the weather forecast, and since Brian is good on the roadways for a week, they decided to go ahead and take the proactive approach of treating the roads today. We know that there's a chance of winter weather rolling in uh, late this week and early next week. And so based on the information, we sent crews out today to pre-treat uh, parts of our roadway with brine. TxDOT spokesman Val Lopez says it's important to be proactive when it comes to treating roadways, even if the possibility of icy conditions in this case is low. What we're trying to do, what we're trying to prevent is from ice bonding on to the roadway. Ice is very different than, let's say, sleep or snow. Those are manageable. You can push those out, off uh, the roadway. Ice is very heavy, very dense, and once, once it bonds, it becomes difficult to remove, and that's what we're trying to prevent with our pretreatment. Lopez says the brine is durable and will hold up through Sunday night and Monday morning. The time frame where the current forecast has a slight chance for wintry precipitation in his Fort Worth district. The spray itself is relatively durable. You'll be able to see as it uh, it's dried stripes are on the roadway. We very much want to spray it on there and let it dry because once it's dry, it'll stay on there until that winter precipitation falls. The focus for this potential event is on bridges and overpasses. The TxDOT Dallas district provided us video of TxDOT crews preparing equipment, but the Dallas district does not plan to begin pre-training operations until Friday. Lopez says even with the treated roads, if there is any freezing rain and given the bitter cold temperatures in the forecast, it is still better for people to stay off the roads if they can on MLK Day. We're hoping that people do stay at home if they're given the option. It should be a vacation day for many people. And of course, the schools will be closed as well. So it's a good, it's a good excuse to stay at home and enjoy the company of your children. The city of Dallas has a new policy to pre-treat roads before the icy weather comes. We reached out to the city of Dallas and the city of Fort Worth to see if they are starting that process. The city of Dallas says they are waiting to see if there are any changes to the forecast first.